Hi everybody, it's Andrea here. You'll have to excuse me, I just got back from swimming so I look alright today. I know I do. I can't hear either because I've got water in my ears. I'm here today to give you a review of Drag Teen by Jeffrey Self. Now, I've only seen this book on another booktube video at the moment and that was on Peter Mons. Peter likes books and I'm going to link to his channel below. He has done a review of this book. I haven't actually watched his review because I didn't want it to influence what I thought about the book and um, he did recommend it so I thought well, well give it a try so I went out and bought it I'm glad I did all I guess about this book is why didn't they have this book when I was growing up <sighs> even as an older straight woman I just find this book brilliant it's just so moving there's just such a good friendship between JT and his, his boyfriend Seth and their friend Heather they make such a wonderful trio of, of people, and I want to say misfits, but they're really not. They're like just normal people. So Seth and JT are going out. JT's got very, very little self-confidence, and he can't afford to go to college. Um, he's tried to get every scholarship under the sun, and he can't get it. But his last chance is to go to Drag Teen, Miss Drag Teen in New York. Now, he doesn't have the confidence to do it the one time he did drag he was uh, was at his school talent show and it did not go well i'm not going to say anything else because i don't really want to spoil the book for anybody who does want to read it because it is fantastic what i will say though is that jeffrey self has created three wonderful characters even the the peripheral characters are fantastically written there are some truly moving spots in this i was in tears at one point because i just empathize so much with JT and his feelings of being left out and not belonging even though he was happy being gay and he's, he, was, he knew he was gay from the time he was little there was still that outsider feeling he had I think we all have it from time to time and I really really empathized with him I wanted him to do well and I was rooting for him all the way through so I'm not going to tell you what happens he does go to New York he meets some fabulous people along the way he meets some fabulous drag queens. I mean, what drag queens aren't fabulous, let's be honest. <laughs> I have drag queen friends myself and I, I love I love them to bits. They're fabulous. All I'm going to say is, if you want a good YA read, please pick this up. It is so moving, so... Oh, it, it, it touched me. It really touched me. Like I said, I was in tears and at the end of it, I just wanted to hug the book forever. Now, as you know, I recently bought a book this is the book to put quotes in. The first quote is actually from Drag, Drag Teen. And it made me realise that I only want to put quotes in the book that really, really appeal to me. That really mean something. So the first quote, and the only quote so far, the only one on the page, is from Drag Teen. And this is, this is just, it just says everything. Everything about the book and everything about life itself. And Seth says this to JT, he says, be who you are, 100%, and see how great you are. And that just, even thinking of it, I'm welling up. And I don't cry a lot at books. I cry at like dog programs and cats and, and her animals and her children. But I don't generally cry at books. It's gotta be something powerful to move me like this. Now, like I said, I haven't watched Peter Mon's um, review. I am gonna go and watch it. but. I loved it so much. I have given it five out of five stars on Goodreads. I will be posting a full review on my blog, which is books, 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 uh, two hundred um, dot wordpress dot com. I will link that as well in the in the notes below. As, and, and the back, when life gets up ugly, don't wig out, drag up. I mean, it's fantastic. Drag it up. Who wouldn't? I mean, yeah. And it's how he learns to be who he wants to be and who he is and what makes him happy is just such a beautiful story if you do want a good and it's a feel good read if you do want a feel good read go and buy this that's my advice now that's all for me today it's just a quick one i will be back soon with a bit of a book haul because i got a load of books for my birthday which i haven't hauled yet because i was on holiday and i've also bought back 15 books in july already yeah because i am that kind of bad and of course monday Book two with on starts. It's so exciting. I can't wait to, to see all the challenges and see what everybody's reading. I've been watching some of your videos. So if I haven't watched it yet, I will. And I am quote, um, can't comment in as well. If you like this video, obviously give it a thumbs up. If you like it, subscribe. But just pick up this book, please. 
I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.